Welcome back, everyone, to this edition of <laughs> Try Our Game with me, Roll Games to me. Where I do the best I can what I've got, which is not a lot of talent, but a whole lot of. Uh, I think. <laughs> I think Jimmy's last message came up. Hello, YouTube. There was a context that, honestly, she's not just being rude. <laughs> <laughs> no, no sorries. No sorries. People on YouTube know by now that this is a Twitch stream. It says right in the thumbnail. Very large, bold letters. Twitch replay. You want to see all this behind the scenes stuff? Twitch.tv slash TV. And while you're there, exclam Twitch will, uh, or exclam tip will help me pay for the stream. <laughs> no, please. Nobody, uh, nobody spend any money on this poor soul. I had a regular subscriber when uh, when uh, I was doing Minecraft. I couldn't understand why everyone wanted to spend money on watching me play Minecraft, but I stopped playing Minecraft, and he decided, you know, why am I paying money to this guy? Okay, let's see. Which one of these have I not added to my list? Uh, Riverside Repair. That's on my list. Stuck Trailer. I don't think this one's on my list. No, it is. Is that the same one? Because there's several stuck trailers. Okay, that's on my list. Uh, meteorology data. I know I've got on my list, right? Yes. Uh, Pinewood Express. I don't think that one's on my list. No. Oh, it is. Um, <laughs> food delivery, I know it's not on my list because I've already done it. Drowned highway truck, is that on my list? No, it isn't. Okay. Okay, so that's something I need on my list. I can actually probably pull it out with this uh, scout. Stuck trailer. That is on my list. Oh, it's the same. It's showing me twice because there's the pickup point and also the delivery point. Okay. And Motel Woes is on my list. So, so far, there's, there's actually only one task that I haven't unlocked. All right. Let's go unlock that. And while I'm unlocking it, I might as well go drag it back. Can I get that? I probably can't get that with the scout. Okay. So let's go pull the... Uh... I'll, I'll keep this out because I'm going to do a scout. Um, do some scouting here this episode. But I will pull out the uh, Zix. What have I got on here? Let's get the bed on here. Because I'm more likely to use that. Sideboard bed. And I've got the loading crane on. Okay. Oh, that's bright. I should have pulled the other thing out of the way first. Okay, so let's see. Gonna go here and here. A lot of these, a lot of these uh, tasks are. This is another one of the tasks that are pretty easy. Just go get this truck out of the mud. I mean, they're pretty easy for this you know, vehicle. And where do I have to take him back to? Oh, I, don't, I won't know until I get there. And activate the uh, task. Oh, uh, what I might do is do uh, one of the challenges with uh, uh, the Brigadier. The time challenges. Because I got two challenges on this map left. 
One uses the Brigadier, one uses the uh, Scout truck. Now, I will say the Scout one will be more entertaining. Because <laughs> I'm more likely to fail. It, you have to use first person. Tebs, I know you said, I think I found the perfect game when I was uh, doing, uh, now that I'm doing SnowRunner. I think you might be right, because it's a game that I can fail in, and yet still be entertaining. <laughs> when I was playing Minecraft, that was the same way, so, you know, I had, uh, had people that enjoyed watching my Minecraft content, it was the same way. I turn. Yes, it is. Ah, see, I try not to set the waypoint so close. Oh, I didn't take down the mailboxes. I did it wrong. I used to love Super Tramp. Oh, man. Not only did I get all the Super Tramp albums, but I got all the albums that were solo albums by the people that were in Super Tramp. Okay, let's uh, back this up. This is going to be much easier. But I do have to get close enough to trigger this on. Here we go. Show task. Accept. And start tracking it. And I have to deliver it to the farm. Okay, easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Why is it lemon? Why isn't it like orange squeezy? Well, okay, that I need you another two letter word. Apple squeezy. Well you don't really squeeze apples to get the juice out here. You mash apples. Grapefruit squeezy. No, that's three syllables. Okay. That's it. Another two-syllable fruit that you get juice out of by squeezing. I gotta think of one. Before the end of the day, I have to think of one. My roommate's in the kitchen. She'll probably save me. She's got her headset on, though. She can't hear me. Somehow, whenever uh, she comes out into the common area, she has her head headphones on. I can't understand why. <laughs> okay. Turn here. Go there. Did I get all these other drowned things? I guess I got all the other drowned things already. I'm making so much progress in this game, I didn't even realize. It's over there. And, oh, is that too far away to quick wrench? Uh, this way. Freezer. Freezer. Get the line right. Uh, okay. And no, I don't have to turn on the engine. I might even steal the fuel out of it. Not with this baby. I dragged a, a, the long five bed, five slot semi bed upside down the whole way as I only do easy mode I don't know what you're lolling at but uh, thanks <laughs> oh I forgot I'm just gonna grab pretzels because I'm hungry I forgot to grab pretzels Excellent. My roommate is cooking something. I'm even more hungry now. Maybe I'll just grab a, uh, next break I'll grab a frozen macaroni and cheese. I try to keep a couple of frozen macaroni and cheese in the freezer. <laughs> I keep it with the freezer. That's the whole point of being frozen macaroni and cheese. I try to keep a couple frozen macaroni and cheese around so that I can uh, uh, use them during my marathon streams. 
Next marathon stream, 12-hour marathon stream, is going to be the first Saturday in May. Celebrate the middle of each season. That'll be the mid-spring. Mid-winter came and went. First weekend in November. Oh, no, wait. Mid-winter was first weekend of February. November's fall. Whatever. February, May, August, and November. And, yes, I have to... I have to uh, go through the months in my head every time so I know what they are. First first Saturday in those months are almost always the exact, or right around the exact center of the season, so it's mid-season. Anyway, 12 hours from, uh, from noon U.S. Central Time until midnight U.S. Central Time, or 6, uh... PM to 6 AM GMT or BST depending on what time of the year it is. Uh wrong button. Give me good light. Although oh I'm not gonna do it. Oh wait, I wanna see something else. I'm not gonna do it in the um I'm not going to do it now, but if you put your lights on and you drive around at night, you get these, like, ghost wolves that show up. And if you're in first person, it's really spooky. Anyway, I'm going to hit the horn, see if I can get the birds to fly. Yep, there they go. There's the crows. Depending on where you are, you might get different birds. You can get the crows to fly if you're on the farm. I love it. Okay. What was I doing next? <laughs> oh, was I going to brave doing the scout thing? Yeah, sure. Like I said, it'll be funny and entertaining. Okay, I'm going to go recover this vehicle, and then I'm going to do meteorological data. Yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's go there. What you have to do for meteorological data is... Visit three different mountain peaks. Why don't I not see them all? Oh, there's the East Weather Station. Oh. Why isn't it showing me? Oh, so I haven't found it. Aha. Uh -huh. I was deceived because it found the uh, other things. That's not where you trigger it. Where do you trigger it? Do I have to do something else to trigger it? It should be on my map. There, that's why I triggered. Okay, that's where I have to go to trigger it. And then, once you trigger it, you've got like 11 minutes or something. Ten and a half minutes to visit these three different mountain peaks. One, two, three. And uh, to do it in ten and a half minutes, you've got to be kind of uh you gotta like crash your way through here and i don't remember what path i took but you got to get down to this road quickly there's a fence here you want to get to the right of you think it's right there I'm going to mark this out. I should get in the right vehicle to mark this out, shouldn't I? And then you got to get to do these things like in order. And I got there. I was completely lost when I did this the first time. And uh, thought there's no way I'm making 11 minutes and 30 seconds. I ended up doing it in like 11 minutes and 28 seconds. Uh, recover. 
Okay. But yeah, it's fun because you have to be in uh, first person mode for it to work. Okay. Now I can set all this stuff. Uh, why is it saying Motel Wolves? Oh, because I haven't triggered it. Now it'll show me. Okay. The timers, you don't, you, if you, once you accept them, you have to do them. There's a quick way of getting up here. Okay. This way, there's a way to cut through the woods. I don't remember what that is. But as long as I don't get lost this time, I should be okay. I should probably drive over there before I finish this because I'm getting confused with that. Yeah, see, I'm, do I'm driving the wrong thing now. Uh, yeah, I got myself all confused. I'm trying to go there and I'm drawing the path not where I'm trying to go. How am I getting there? This is one way to go. I don't have to go in first person to actually get there. Just okay, let me get over there. Uh, yeah. Go past the warehouse. Something like that. Okay, let me get over there, and then uh, we'll get it done. Lights. The worst part about this vehicle, though... Um, no beacons. I don't think there's even a beacon option. I mean, it's a great truck, don't get me wrong. It's the best scouting car that's available early game. I mean, you do have to pay money for it. It's like two dollars or something real money but there's no beacons i mean is it really worth it if there's no beacons spending two dollars for a, for a vehicle if there's no beacons i guess maybe if i uh if i wrote them a letter i could say look i mean i like the vehicle and all but can i get a little discount because there's no beacons I just went crashing right in the mud. Probably not the fastest way to get there. But this thing has persistent um, X button stuff. Diff lock. I had a look at the screen. Does this horn scare the crows? Uh, no, but it kind of scares me. Oh, wait, there are, there is a different, I wasn't in crow territory, there was a different part of here. Oh, I just see the shadows, I don't see the birds now. Okay, little birds, they're like sparrows or something. Well, I drove right over that rock, like it was nothing. Then once they get over there, it's going to take me a few minutes to lay out the path. Excuse me for the sound? <laughs> Did I wake you up? I'm sorry, were you nodding off? It's, it's not your bedtime yet, right? Is that the way I was going? No, this is the way I was going. Yeah, 
that way. Yep, it is your bedtime? <laughs> the 20 second delay is great, because then I can ask you two questions, and I can get you to answer the first question. <laughs> and, uh, you know, then it sounds like you're answering the wrong question. I don't know with my new equipment, I don't think I'll still be able to turn on the low latency because I think that's a product of the light stream, um, the light stream tool I'm using. Oh, is it through here? Let's see here. No, I think that's a function of them. They won't allow low latency mode. Twitch has a low latency mode so that you don't have to wait the 20 seconds. I don't have... You, you don't have to wait the 20 seconds after I say something to hear what I'm saying. As it is now, I'll say something and it's 20 seconds before you guys get to hear it. The low latency mode allows me to react to my users faster, but that would mean I'd have to actually be paying attention to what my, uh, or my viewers, but that means I'd have to actually be paying attention to what my viewers are, are saying and doing, which, you know, I don't do anyway. You were just writing explanation, too. <laughs> I am not, people have requested that I put on TTS, which I can do. Uh, for streaming, but I'm not doing. Oh, why did I put the thing there? Yeah, I'm not putting on text to speech because uh, that'll go right out to YouTube. And I'm not sure I can tr trust the uh, language filter enough for that. And YouTube, they won't. They won't monitor a little text on the screen, but they'll, if they hear a bad word, they'll, uh, they might, I might let be, they might tell me about that. Actually, it's usually only in the first 30 seconds that they monitor, but I guess they say in their, their user agreement, excessive language use. How do they determine excessive? They don't de determine, they don't say what excessive means. So what's, yeah, I think they don't say because it varies depending on their mood, depending on their uh, algorithm's mood, the AI mood, mood, I think, you know, their, their AI might get cranky. It's through there. Oh, right. That's the way I said I was going to go back. Is that right? Oh, what? How did I mess this up? Well, I am going to go back that way. See if that works. I'll get to practice. Yeah, it's like through there. It's just past... Yes, this is where I want to turn off. Just when I come back. Just past this guardrail. That's the way to sneak in. Sneaking in doesn't matter, though. I have to be able to sneak out. And, uh, great thing about this vehicle is I usually don't have to worry about the slope. Okay, so... I will, uh... I do have to worry about that tree stump, though. Remember, this is all going to be in first-person view, so I won't necessarily be able to see where I'm going. You know, I'm not going to accept this right away, but I'm going to show the task. Stop my engine, because I already used too much fuel. Okay. And... If you look under Avoid These Interactions... I can't recover, obviously. I can't change the truck. 
and I can't go to the garage. That's all normal. What isn't normal in these challenges, what's written underneath that? Cockpit view required. And when I played this the first time, you're talking a lot of, a loud of, uh, you're talking a lot of rubbish. Your, your auto type fails you again. I talk, a, you might talk a lot of rubbish. I talk a lot of rubbish. <laughs> All right, so let's go to the map and let's lay this out. Meteorological data. Now, getting to these things, I have a limited amount of time. And I have to do this in first person. So the way to do it, I have to really very in very much detail make an awful lot of marks on the screen so I know where I'm going because I'll be flying blind other than following the blue dots okay and then where's the first first one is there it's easiest if you do them in, in in uh, clockwise order. So. Then it's through here, but then. Yeah, there's the trail. Okay. Make some intermediate points. And I'll show this. I actually took a screenshot last time of the path I took, but I'm not going to look that up right now. And then through... Those crows now are driving me crazy, all right? Just calm down. Okay, right through there. Then, to get to the next one... There probably is another shortcut I could take. There is. So let's turn around, go back to here. That's the key to doing these in time, is learning all the shortcuts. And hopefully this time I'll be able to do it in, in 10 and a half minutes easily. So having having done it once before, although you know that would mean counting on my muscle memory, counting on my memory period. Okay, a little shortcut through there. there. All right, now probably easiest to just go right down the hill there. That's two. And then three, I can drive right off the cliff. Actually, if I double back and went through there, is that faster than... No, that's through the... Yeah, that's... This is the way to go. I think. Either around there or around here. And it's probably fast to go around here. If I was bold, I would go right through these trees, but I'm not sure I can actually get a break through the trees. So I'm gonna just double back. I do have more than one attempt at this. I'm not playing in hard mode, I'm playing in easy mode. I can take as many tries as I need to. And again, there's a, a break in the guardrail there. I don't get through. Okay. Okay, that's it. Success or fail, uh, you have crows all around your house. 
they live at the church uh, close by and they chirp on your chimneys, you don't mind them. I wouldn't mind them either. It's the doves that won't shut up and they drive me mad. <laughs> Maybe if it wasn't for the crows, the doves wouldn't uh, be a problem. Is that, are those rock doves that we call pigeons here? Or they're just, they're, they're nice looking doves. Actually, I think pigeons look beautiful. I think they look gorgeous, doves. Or uh, pigeons with the blue, you know, the translucent kind of uh, feathering they have on the front. Anyway, okay, let me uh, get ready to go here. I'm not going to wait the 20 seconds for your response. Sorry, Jeff. <laughs> I don't have to go in. It should be easier for me this time. First time I failed because um, I had the change view button on the same joystick as my steering wheel. And if I steer the wrong way, I clench. Yeah, pigeon does. You can cope with the bigger pigeons. All right. I used to love as a kid, I would go to the uh, park in, in the center of town, and there were like tons of pigeons there. And I would get, they, there was a uh, nut dealer. They had fresh roasted other nuts, but they had fresh roasted peanuts. And. They were warm out of the bag. You would get them and I would take the peanuts and take them to the park and toss them to the pigeons. This was, you know, 50 years ago when, when things were actually cheap. And, uh, and the pigeons would go crazy for the peanuts. And I was a kid. I didn't care about the poop. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's do this. Activate the contest. Oh, I should have started the engine. Oh, that way. And the handbrake's on. Oh, great. Well, okay, that's a waste of five seconds. It's this way. Oh, go, go. Just trust that I laid these waypoints right. Okay, just trust. You're fine. You don't have to rush it. But, uh,. I mean, ten and a half minutes is a surprisingly long time. But you do have to not get lost. And you do have to be able to see the road. I'm going to get a little closer. Make my field of view better. There's enough room on the left side of that. So I'm go to the right side of this. Okay. And in this vehicle with the tires it has, all-wheel drive is more important on the asphalt than it is on the uh, uh, the mud. Okay, now don't miss my turn off. I think I can go to the map um, if I get lost, but I can't change view. So I have to make sure I don't hit the wrong button and change view <laughs> while I'm trying to go to the map. I have a lot of confidence this time, though. Uh, unjustified confidence, but I have a lot of confidence. I'm going to Dunning Kruger it all the way. I've had just enough experience that I think I'm an expert, even though I know nothing. Through those trees. I think I can knock that tree down, but I'm not going to try. No, that's a little bit too, too big for this vehicle. Oh, not too long ago, I remember trying. There were these, what looked like really small trees. I was in the big monster truck, and the trees were defeating me. These little tiny twig trees. I couldn't get past them, couldn't get through them. This is not the kind of task you want to do in the Scout 800. As it would have fallen over way by now. Am I turning here then? Apparently I'm turning here. Yes, and up here. 
and uh, okay, now I'm lost. I didn't turn all the way. Or, oh, I got the one. So now I have to go back the way I came. Oh, come on. How am I gonna do this? Here? Uh, apparently? Here? There it is. All right. I'm on the road again. I can't, like I said, I can't go to the map if I get lost. It doesn't make a sound. It should make a sound when you get to one. It should give you a trumpet or something. Yeah, it should do that. The, the, it should do a trumpet and the doves should come out and poo. The peace doves. Up here. I got this. I got this. This one is near the waypoint, so it's easy to find. Oh, wait. What? What am I hitting? What am I hitting? Oh, I guess I gotta back up. Oh, I guess I'm hitting that rock. All right. Oh, no! Wait! No! No! Oh, this is a bad time to start tipping. Oh, that's rock is I'm hitting. Yeah, okay. This side of that rock. Okay. Oh, no. Wait. Some of them, you have to not take too much damage. This one, fortunately, you can take as much damage as you want. Okay, it's up here? Apparently? Did I get it? Uh, did I get it? I got it. Okay, now I gotta turn around again. Uh, and go which way now? Where's the marker? That way. Okay. And avoid the rock again. Okay, the last one, I think, is the easiest. It's mostly good roads. Okay. Oh, the tension! Will he make it? I've got two of them in five minutes. I should make it, right? Now this way. This one I have to turn. No. I have to turn right there. I'm not looking at the chat. I'm not looking at you laughing at me, Chubb. You can laugh at me all you want. I'm not looking. Ah! Oh! I'm sitting all the way forward in the truck. I'm also sitting all the way forward in, uh, on the couch. IRL. Okay, I'm serious now. I've got my tongue out again. First try. I'm going to do this first try. I think it's right up there. I actually got gold on every one of these challenges. This one I failed the first attempt because I accidentally changed views. But then after that, the first time I finished, I got gold. Um, and then I failed only one other one after that. Got it! Yay, Sox is watching! She likes drama, huh? <laughs> drama queen. She's a cat. Of course, she's a drama queen. My cat is a drama queen. All right, I can get out of this view now. What was my time? Oh, I hit the... I hit the... Anybody catch the time? Thanks. I hit the accept button too fast. I have to go look at the time. Okay, anything else to do with this vehicle? Where am I just going to, uh... I know it was well under ten and a half minutes. I know that much. 
These early ones, at least in uh, Michigan, are pretty easy. Like I said, I only failed to get gold one time, and that's because I was sitting there for two minutes trying to find where the drop-off point was. It was, like, right next to me, and I couldn't find it. Oh, actually, I think that was in Alaska. Maybe that was in Alaska. Okay, so I did meteorological data once, so it came off my task list. The other one is Pinewood Express. I don't think I have time to get that set up. So let me do something else. Stuck trailer. Uh, curtain side trailer. Where does that one go? I can probably do that in this vehicle. It'd be faster just to go. Where does it go? Driller, oh, trailer park. Deliver trailer park. Okay. Oh. So where's the trailer? There. Uh, okay. I got uh, 10 minutes to get this done. It's probably not going to help. Um, can, I, I'm, can I get through these trees is the question. This will be the ne next task I do. It's a curtain side trailer though, which means I can winch it with this thing, but it's pretty heavy. I'll, I'll pull out the other vehicle. So yeah, let me, uh, let me recover and get set up. I could, I could check out the view while I'm here. Oh, look at that view. This game does have really nice graphics. And this is on a OG Xbox. You get the new uh, Xbox. It's even nicer, I think. Okay, let me recover. And pull uh, this baby out. And mark the trail, and then I'm going to take a break. Oh, fastest way of getting there. Hmm. Well, the most fuel efficient way would be just to take the uh, city roads, but I think the fastest way to get there, since this truck is slow, as slow on city streets as it is on difficult streets. We might as well. Could even cut across that swamp, but I won't. Yeah, I'll go down through the, uh, through the, um, drilling site. And this thing can cut across here, I know, in the drilling site, so I will, if I can. Easily do that. You're gonna go now? Okay! Thanks for stopping by, Chubbs. I appreciate it, as always. I'll, uh, maybe, maybe see you next week. Now that I've won one race in TT All Man, maybe uh, you'll stop by on Saturdays. Actually, your only incentive for stopping by that is to watch me fall off. So if I don't fall off, I know you're not going to stop by. I did still fall off. I just still won the race. No, ugh. I have all these multiple. I'm not going to be able to fix that. Yeah, now the question is, do I go around or do I just go straight across here? I'm pretty sure I just go straight across here.
And I'm pretty sure I can. Something like that. Okay, something like that. And then through the trees, deliver it, point north from the garage. When I come back, that's going to be the next challenge. So uh, if you're watching on Twitch, let me uh, actually switch to morning. If you're watching on Twitch, I'm going to take a two-minute break. If you're watching the VOD or whatever, and I will be uh, right back to get that task done. If you're watching on YouTube, that'll be in the next episode, which will come out the next weekday after this episode at 12 noon U.S. Central Time. All right, Twitch, stick around. YouTube, next episode. Either way, I will see you then.